Secretary Coleman said he will recommend that Congress extend auto safety regulations imposed in 1972. At that time, automakers were required to equip all new cars with either seat belts or passive restraints like airbags. Coleman also said he would decide by the end of this year whether airbag systems should be required in all new cars. The secretary conceded that airbags are controversial and that mandatory airbag systems raised questions regarding freedom of choice. But Coleman added, passive restraints are attractive because seat belts too often are not used and passive restraints would operate automatically. Transportation Department figures project that more than 11,000 lives could be saved each year by airbag systems. The Transportation Department will hold public hearings on airbags in August. Coleman's final decision will be back to congressional review.